Hello, welcome to IFTV. I'm Kim Ingalls and it's our day four roundup of the NWG Innovation Festival at Newcastle Racecourse. It's really crunch time. We'll be finding out just exactly where our sprints have got to, ready for the feedback session tomorrow. Before we get to all of that though, let's have a look at Battle of the Bands from last night and see who is raising the roof. Well, I'm in a rather be out, but I can walk in outside of my rainbow smile, but be free. I have one of the leaders from the Keep It Flowing Sprint with me now, Ian Cleaver. Now you're talking about leaks. We really are at crunch day. What have you come up with? Well, we've come up with uh, six key themes. And from those six key themes, we've come up with 17 projects that we're looking to move forward. 17? Yeah, 17. A bit of a problem because they're all good. Uh, so what we did yesterday is we voted on which ones we thought were uh, the best. And from that, as we are at the moment, is looking at getting down to four or five we can take forward and give to the business. Now we have delegates flying in from all over the world. One of them is Peter Bork. I'm based in Hong Kong and i um, very pleased to be here today on such a beautiful day. The general atmosphere is one of being focused and today that is one of the most critical things that you can do. So the focus leads to outcomes. And certainly, only having been here for a couple of hours and only spent a little bit of time so far, it is very clear that outcomes are what are driving the discussions, the workshops, the hackathons and everything else that's going on here. BT is one of this week's high profile main headline sponsors and with me is Tom Baker. Tom, BT, why are they involved with the water company? Well, if you think about what BT does, we manage quite a complex network ourselves, Northumbria Water, also a very complex network focused business. We transport bits and bytes, Northumbria transport water, so many synergies there. We operate across the same geographies, we have the same customers, we have a lot of the same challenges. So the opportunity to be here this week and to do a bit of mutual learning and plot how we can both improve our businesses, too good of opportunity to pass up really. So there's a taste of what the teams have been up to when it's crunch time. We'll have more for you at 7 o'clock. Join us then.